What's Van Ruff here from 9 no Anime, and I am here with Sky Daddy H Man and Sioni, and we are doing more of Gravity Falls. You ready? I'm ready to go look at the oh, mystery shack. Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah. It was me screaming, just deal with it. I'm excited, dude. I this honestly, this has been like the most fun series that I've been reacting to in a long time. And I think it's because it's different. Like it's not anime, but I, I've been I've been waiting. i I don't want to say anything else. Click the like button, subscribe, do the things. Let's go. Oh no! <laughs> Duck detective. <laughs> That duck is a genius. Goddamn right. So I was cleaning up when I found the secret door. I love this guy. Crazy, bonkers, creepy. Whoa. Hello. Ah! <laughs> it's Grandpa's Day. creeping in the fucking ah! attic. Behold the Gravity mm. Falls Wax Museum. For my personal favorite, Wax Abraham Lincoln. Oh, oh no. no. Who left the blinds open? Wax John Wilkes Booth, I'm looking in your direction. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. It's funny because that is a joke that 90% of the generation who was watching this on TV did not understand. Yeah, that's true. Because this was on Disney. At what point is it safe to actually do a joke like that? No, in the immediately after. Rule is 20 years. 20 years. That means that we can make 9 11 jokes. But, like, I'm more curious, like, at what point like, is it okay, like, TV shows? Immediately after. We all gotta stop being babies about stuff. I say immediately. Yeah. I think that's the best time. Rip it yeah, out of the box like, immediately. It's, all, it's, it's also, like, out of respect to, like, the loved ones, though. Like, that were lost in... Well, yes, you know, but John Wilkes Booth, I mean, eh, fucking Lincoln's been dead for years. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm just saying, like... I think um, TV shows have the ability to do it very quickly yeah. because it's a TV show, and... It's there for entertainment, and you know that, so you Based can laugh time. because you're you're in your home. Are right. you asking because you also want to make a 9-11 joke? Like, what is going on here? <laughs> no, no, I'm a, I'm asking just because out of general curiosity. But let, let let's continue. Okay. That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that in the eye. I'll make you a new wax figure from all this old wax. She's part fairy princess and part horse fairy princess. Maybe well, she calls oh. Uh, like a waffle with big arms. Yes. That, yes. yes. That. You know, like, like She's very good at art. Kids, she is. My pants? <laughs> oh, Muse, you work in mysterious ways. How much wax did they have? Apparently a lot. It needs more glitter. What do you think? That would freak me out. The wax museum's back in business. I, saw, I, I think it needs more glitter. I agree. Hands her a bucket of glitter. How many people come to see a wax museum? Up. I know. Right? A lot. You'd be surprised, yeah. Them or something. There's one in oh, Vegas, bro. Yeah, that one's Vegas. super popular. Dude, and tell me another place that has a wax museum. Has never known. Missouri does. There you go. There's the other state. Me. <laughs> it's covered in my blood, sweat, tears, and other fluids. Oh, what? Well, you know, what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Local kook. It's local this guy. Yeah, local kook. Question. Can I survive the wax man uprising? Oh. Yes. Next question. Your flyers promised free pizza with admission to this event. It That's that a, a problem. Good night, everyone. That was a typo. <laughs> <laughs> I only was there for free pizza. Oh my god. Wow. Well, that's why so many people showed up to their wax museum. Hot pumpkin pie. Yeah. Look at all this cash. I owe it all to one person. This guy. <laughs> yeah, you too, you little grandma. That's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy. He wants some quackers. I would definitely not be okay with hanging out with a wax figure of myself. Wow. Oh, no. <sighs> this is why you don't lie about pizza. Use the John, right? And when I come back, blammo! He's headless! This case is unsolvable. What? That back, Sheriff Blubs. City boy thinks he's gonna solve a mystery with his fancy <laughs> computer phone. City boy? Computer phone. I mean, yeah, that computer would help. Oh. <laughs> like that actually would help though. When did this first come out? You leave the investigating to the um, so 2012. So it was before smartphones, then, right? Uh, well, maybe right when smartphones were still coming. 
No. 2012 is not new for smartphones. I, I graduated 2013, and I definitely well, had, I'm like... Well, I'm sorry you were privileged enough to have a smartphone in 2012. I'm pretty sure most wow. average people this did. This man's over here getting all that not poor people. I didn't have a smartphone until hella late, bro. Yeah, I didn't have a smartphone for a very long time. That's what I was saying. The fact that Sioni knows, I know, because, like, My we get it. We get it. You were rich. No, you were no, rich. I, it was a very <laughs> common thing. It was not. No. Dan rich boy. Has lost his head, and it's up to us to find it. <laughs> I'm, I'm saying it right now. The free pizza guy. 100% him. He had a shirt and everything. Footprints in the shag carpet, and they're leading to. What? <gasps> the lumberjack! Of, of course. course! What? Oh, you mean Manly Dan? Yeah, he hangs out at this crazy intense biker joint downtown. Name is man is Manly Dan? You don't fuck with Manly Dan. I'm doing a memorial service for Wax Dan. Something small, but classy. He's really going all out for himself. He is. Oh, it's called Skull Fracture. That dude's got tattoos that said head and chin. And neck! <laughs> just forgets what body you parts they are. Lumberjack for the murder of Wax Stan. Right, let's just try to blend in, okay? The guy I wanted to see. Can you Where beat by Septicus? <laughs> you were at work. No, I was punching that clock. Ten o'clock. <laughs> what? The time of the murder. So I guess you've never seen this before. I wouldn't pick my teeth with that axe. It's left-handed. <laughs> oh, oh my God! <laughs> by Septicus <laughs> got annihilated. <laughs> Three, Axes four, aren't. Five. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, your wife be beautiful. <laughs> These are all our suspects. Manly Dan is right-handed. That means all we gotta do is find our left-handed suspect, and we've got our killer. We are so, like, what if there's multiple left-handed people, though? Ourselves. Or what if they're ambidextrous? Free pizza oh, guy. Oh, it wasn't free pizza guy. I was wrong. Man, that free pizza dude just keeps getting just wow. let down. Oh no. There's only one person left on this list. What? That was enough? That's all they needed? I don't know. This is a raid. What is this? What the fuck? You're under arrest for the murder of the wax body of Grunkle Stan. Huh. Your little knees must be sore from jumping to conclusions. Mom. I hate him. I knew it. Wait, what, what did you say? Huh? Nothing? We said nothing. Could you repeat? Then where were you the night of the break in? Finally, we can be alone. Cardboard cut out. Oh, no. Shut he's up. a fucking <laughs> creepazoid. Oh, that's weird. I'd be pretty embarrassed if I was you. <laughs> oh, shut up, bro. Wait, you think Grunkle Stan did it? I think the wax figure came to life somehow. You really? Killed himself? Yeah, I'm, I think it was an inside job. The motive, the clues. Wait a minute. What has holes in its shoes and no fingerprints? Oh, another wax figure came to life. Oh, shit! Oh, they're all alive! What the fuck? Wax Shakespeare! Wax Coolio? Congratulations, my two. Wait, Amazon did they murder Abraham Lincoln too? Yup, he brought out the the magnifying glass. Yeah, that doesn't work, bro. Applaud sarcastically. Uh, no, that sounds too sincere. Slow clap. There we go. Nice. <laughs> How is this possible? Just to come to life whenever the moon is Fucking waxing. president. Your uncle bought us many years ago at a garage sale. I love that they're making fun of President Nixon in there. Just come at a terrible price. So the mystery shack oh. wax collection was born. Ha! <laughs> 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 Oh, it all goes back to Seuss. To get our revenge on Stan for oh, away. we got the wrong guy. Oh, shit. What Sherlock the Holmes fuck? got the wrong guy. Uh. They tried to actually kill Grunkle Stan. Well, this is getting weird. What do we do? What for real. Do? Yep, yeah. Anyone move and we'll melt you into candles. That's not how candles work. You yeah, you could try. You can defeat us. Jumps on you. What the fuck is this? This is ridiculous. Hey, why is there nothing in my hand? Wow. 
Not Coolio. Watch out! All right, <laughs> let's get this taken care of. Twinkin' Sherlock Holmes fight with a sword. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Yeah, in general. He can utilize almost any cooler weapon. <laughs> Any last words? Oh no. no! You know, letting me lead you outside, probably not your sharpest decision. A box. It's a total kerfuffle. You sneeze like a kitten. Those policemen yeah. were right. You're adorable. Adorable! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! Uh, She's just eating them into the fireplace. From Mystery after all. I couldn't have done it without my sidekick. What happened to my parlor? Your wax figures turned out to be evil, so he fought them to the death. You kids and your imaginations. Huh. On the bright side, though, but we know people. that Grunkle knows my stuff head. is up because he has a secret room I hidden behind the refrigerator. Guy. Very know, true. Kids. No. Solve the case yet, boy? <laughs> 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 Wow, that got weird. Oh, God damn it, dude. Oh, no. But he's just ahead. Well, hmm. bye, bro. What do you think is better? He's the only he wax figure that actually survived. The llama hair. Huh? Llamas are nature's greatest warrior. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like Gravity Falls? Bob Psycho. 86. Cowboy Bebop. The live action. Naruto Shippuden? The one with the swing set? Then swing over to Patreon at patreon.com slash anime. You get all that stuff early and uncut. And sexy. Can we go back to the reaction now? Tonight's final illusion. We have the incredible sack of mystery. When you put your money in, it mysteriously disappears. No way. I was totally worth the drive. Tiger Fizz. I was not expecting that. Are you completely miserable? What makes him so special? Gideon? He's a psychic. A so don't waste your time with other. What's the Scooby Doo noise there? Ever since that monster Gideon rolled into town, I've had nothing but trouble. Oh no, he stole his spot. I think we should go and find out. Step right up there, folks. Put your money in Gideon's psychic sack. Is it that easy to take money from people? In steps? honestly, kind of. The mystery shack. They even have their own Zeus. <laughs> I don't like that. Seuss, you're better, dude. Don't listen to them. Seuss just got so angry. That stands mortal enemy. And uh not what I expected. Ladies and gentlemen, it is such a gift to have you here tonight. I don't like him. What the fuck? What others can't see. No. What? He's very charismatic. He has some sort of like weird fucked up powers. Something tells me your name, Mabel. How do you do that? So I'm sure he says it. Sure. But he he can write a damn good song. I think he's he's a lot older than what he seems to. Oh, 100 percent. Yeah, he's not a. He's gonna. He's get definitely not gonna get this real deep voice. Mm -hmm. I don't think so because the person playing the piano was his dad. When I saw you in the audience, I said to myself, <laughs> what, now, what the fuck? Spirit, someone who appreciates the uh, sparkly things in life. <laughs> Utterly enchanting. Do you see something you like? Well, what? he got a crush. He, he really does. Crush. Whoa, where have you been? You look like a wolverine. I know. Right? <laughs> ah, <laughs> hang up, my new pal, Gideon. I don't trust anyone whose hair is bigger than their head. That's a fair, honestly. Words to live by. You never trusted Marge? All the time. What do you mean? No. Hey, dude, you ready to blow up these hot dogs in the microwave one by one? You can do that? Really? They just blow up? Have you guys never uh, put a hot dog in a microwave? Not for more than like a few seconds to heat it oh, up. Okay, yeah, yeah. No, you, you put it in there for long enough and the heat and they, they split open and they go poof. Yeah, I don't want to clean that up. I'm good. Hard pass. Well, it Thanks doesn't ex it doesn't explode in such like such a way that it's covering everything. They'll just pop and they'll split open. I can't uh, believe neither of you have ever cooked a hot dog for a little too long in a microwave. I burned yeah. popcorn. 
to, until I learned the ma the master technique to make popcorn. So what you do is you wait until at the end of the bag of the popcorn until you stop hearing it pop uh, for 10 seconds. Okay. Once you once you stop hearing it pop for 10 seconds, and if it stops for 10 seconds, pull the bag out. It's done. I mean, that is normally how you tell is the lack of popping. Yeah, I was thinking the but same thing. The issue is sometimes they burn before the lack of popping. If you haven't popcorn that education, yet, everybody. I, now I want you're, popcorn. You're a little burned. Okay, I don't want to tell you. I, hey. See, I'm wondering if he actually likes her or if he's trying to use her, like with the uh, gnomes. You are being so nice to me right now. <laughs> well, Kitty and I am. Um, Kid, no, that's. I like no, that's weird. stop. Let's just be friends, Mabel. No. Will you do me the honor of going on a date with no. me? No. I don't know. He's scheming for something. I don't know what it is, but. This is just weird. No, this is not weird. good, girl. You need to run. It's so girl, funny run. For, for him to think, or for her to think he's creepy, is kind of massive because she likes everybody. Ah, uh, that's true. I didn't even think about that. Like that first episode, she asked out everybody. That is true. That is, yeah, that's a good point. He's about to be so extra. Doug Dimmadome. He literally looks like a little Doug Dimmadome. The horse is in the restaurant. That little shyster is dating my great niece. Make it belly on. There's a magazine. I didn't know. I didn't know about it. Right oh down shit. Oh out. shit. It's gonna stop right uh -oh. now. Got those okay. skin. I'm gonna go beat some heads, bruh. Yeah, this is so weird. Open up. Out of the way, bud. I'm looking for Gideon. Some digs you got here. I hear your niece and my Gideon are, well, they're singing in harmony lately, so to speak. Uh, yeah, and I'm against it. I see a fantastic business the Mystery Shack and the Tent of Telepathy. This is our big chance to brush aside our rivalry and pool our collective profits, you see. It's fake. Mabel cannot state with success. And tomorrow's day promises to top Why 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 she got a lobster and he got peas? Just one date and this was it. Will you accompany Gideon to the ballroom dance? That's fucked up. Yeah, wow, dude. She says no. I'll die from sadness. Shut up, bitch. That will indeed happen. I hear about that will indeed happen. Oh. Oh. That's fucked up. Wow. He asked me out again and I didn't know how to say no. This is probably actually a very important episode for young yeah. girls who are watching this at like 13 and 14. Yeah. Because people no are no. grimy like that. Yep. Yeah, who they just keep pushing and pushing. Yeah. No means no. Feel free to say no. It's yeah. important. No. Vote <laughs> oh, you know, I, I would not trust to have being a boat with that man. Right? Why does he only have floaties on his arms? No, I mean yes. I mean I'm always. I don't know. With a friend, but soulmate. Yo, calm down, bro. I like new people like this growing up too. That like were obsessed and like never gave up. And it's so weird. Like I don't understand. You have to marry Gideon. What? All part of my long-term deal with Buddy Gleeful. Mabel isn't joining you tonight. She's uh, she's kind of weirded out by you. No offense. Oh God. Come between us. Hey, thumbs up. Thumbs up indeed, my friend. No. No. That was so creepy. That place is literally called the club. He's just a kid. He doesn't have any powers. I don't know about that, bro. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? Oh. Clean up your room this instant. I can't buy it. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. Fair, fair enough. Oh, oh. He burnt half that picture with his mind. I can buy and sell you, old man. I'm so glad everything's back to normal. We want to interview you about whether you've seen anything unusual in this here town since you've arrived. Oh, bro, so much. He's not interested in that. No, this is a trap. Tonight? 
hundred percent. Chandra Jimenez's phone number. Oh my oh god, my oh, god. this fucking. That? Yeah, no, that's creepy, bro. Hello. Friend. No, that's so weird. Gideon wow. How long have you been living in this town? A week? Two? You okay, man? Oh. <gasps> You're a fake. <laughs> will be mine that's that's no <laughs> one objects you are now you are ah, she's never gonna date you man wow Get it? we have to talk but i can't be your marshmallow but we can still be makeover buddies right really no not really what the heck <laughs> yeah, give it back. Ha, not so powerful without this are you <laughs> Oh shit! Oh my Whoa. god! What the fuck? Wow. Okie dokie. Gideon, it's over. This isn't the last you'll see of Will. Oh, man. I've never known He's someone to walk into a forest like that. <sighs> He's such a this fucking creep. Living, brother. Recompense for your transgressions. What you got like a word a day calendar or something? <laughs> but, 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 but. <laughs> what about our arrangement with Mabel and the silence? Uh, sorry, Stan. I have to side with Gideon on this one. Oh. Stan, try and catch nope, me nope. Second. It's his painting now. <laughs> that is Stan's painting. Uh huh. Sad clown. I could have had it all. Yeah, the little mutant swore vengeance on the whole family. Yeah, how's he gonna destroy us now, huh? Try to guess what number we're thinking of? I'll never guess what number I'm thinking of. Negative eight. No one would guess a negative number. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's not wrong. I know, that's very true. <laughs> but now I know she needs a new number now. It's a mystery oh, hack. He's making no. a Gideon, I still love you. Oh, that's so <laughs> creepy. Hey, what are you going to do without your precious amulet? You'll see. What? Oh. So there's multiple of those goddamn books, dude. This show is wild. Why is she bedazzled Seuss? <laughs> 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 this is great. Oh my god, dude. I love Seuss. I'm wow. so happy that he's like a running character. You're all fired. <laughs> You're all fired. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> he's gone now. <laughs> Oh, that was good two episodes. Wow. Dude, the show is fantastic. Yeah, it's, I am I curious. Mean, it's funny. I'm very curious what the big like reveal is going to be, though, because they're obviously building up to something now that they're showing that book. And I honestly didn't think it was going to be that. I thought it was just going to be ridiculousness over and over and over again. I wonder well, what they're building what, into, what the books mean. Uh, mm -hmm. Dipper has what, number one or number three? He has number three, I think. I think so, or like the number's not there, but yeah, I don't. Well, how I know many are there? On it. I know is there on three? It. Is there four? Is there five? Is there twelve? Yo, what if what if Grunkle Stan has number one? I mean, Grunkle Stan got a fucking something underneath the he, house. He does hiding behind the door. <laughs> Grunkle, that's that's the crazy part. Is Grunkle Stan is hiding something. I want to know like, what. I mean, we so 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 far we have. Was the the little elves? We the got gnomes. the the gnomes. Yeah, we got Mister <laughs> Psychic elves. Boy. Whatever. We got the the crazy dude who makes giant robots of death. But there's also then, is a giant thing yeah, in the lake yeah. that we saw. And there is also one in the lake too. Yeah. Hmm. We know Bigfoot's going to be coming probably from the intro at least. It's also the mystery hack now, not the mystery shack. I mean, he is a hack. I don't know. All right. What do you think is the craziest thing that we might see? Of mythical creatures. I'm calling there will be a Chupacabra episode. Yeah. There will be. Um, I'm going to go Cthulhu. Cthulhu? Okay. Yeah. Giant, giant floating space monster. Mm. With, with tentacles. You're probably right. There might even be a flying spaghetti bet. monster in this too. I wouldn't put a pass. Yeah, on. honestly, safe bet. 
Do you not know about Cthulhu, Ruff? I know about Our Cthulhu. Lord Savior. Okay. I know about Cthulhu. Why? I was just making sure the way the way you said. It, I was just I was just wanting to make sure. Want to confirm. Okay. I was gonna be a little disappointed okay. if you didn't. So what do you think is coming? Oh, oh, a fucking dragon! I honestly have no idea. It's a boring guess. It's okay. I mean, I, I, I like next dragons. Video, he'll come up with a better guess. No, nah, a dragon would actually be pretty fire. But thank you all so much. Click the like button. Subscribe. Turn on the bell. If you want the videos early and uncut, you can go to patreon.com slash 9 anime. We're probably about a month ahead of YouTube. So if you don't want to wait for future Gravity Falls videos, you know what to do. Yep. We'll see you later. Also, compliment Ageman. Tell him how good he looks in his little beanie. Don't do right? that. He does look good. Do it. You do. Beanie. You look good in your beanie. Okay. No. Positive affirmations. Bye.